Hey, Team MK Fitness, welcome back. This is Coach Tony for another stretch break. Uh, a few announcements before we get started. Um, I know that our stretch break is a little early in the week this week. Uh, our stretch breaks and our wellness checks have been moved to still at 1215, but on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Also, my Tabata class, instead of 430 on Monday, it's going to be at 7 o'clock this evening. So I hope everybody tunes back in uh, for Tabata later on this evening at 7 p.m. All right, now all of our workouts that, are, that we provide are intended for our Team MK Fitness members. Now, if you're not a member, you can do our workouts, but do so at your own discretion. All right, so let's get to stretching. The first stretch we're going to do, we've done this one before, is a seated figure four stretch. And what you want to do first is find your neutral pelvis. So if I sit to the side here, I don't want your back arched. I don't want you slumped over. I want you somewhere in the middle, okay? Find that neutral pelvis. I want you to cross your right foot over your left knee, okay? Find your neutral pelvis, pelvis and we're gonna stretch our hips and abductors. Ready? Let's stretch, 30 seconds. And remember, try to tuck your shoulder blades into your back pocket so you don't want your shoulders up. Relax your shoulders. Tuck those shoulder blades into your back pocket. Neutral pelvis. Slight pressure on that knee, stretching your hip and your right glute. About five more seconds. Four, three, two, great job. Okay, same stretch, left leg. Sit up tall, neutral pelvis. Shoulder blades in your back pocket. Another 15 seconds. All right, another five, four, three, two, and one. Great job, everyone. Okay, so next stretch, we're working on the hamstrings. So I want you to grab underneath your knee, pick your knee up as far as you're comfortable with, and then extend your leg straight out in front. We're stretching out your hamstring. 30 seconds. Hey, Brenda. Fifteen more seconds. Remember your neutral pelvis, shoulder blades in your back pocket. And relax. Same stretch on your left leg. And stretch. There we go. Feels great. Especially for someone who has hamstring issues. Fifteen more seconds. And five, four, three, two. One, great job. Let's go back to our figure four stretch. Right foot over your left knee, neutral pelvis. Try to find new range of motion. So try to push that knee down a little further this time. You know, I think we do need some music next time, Maria. Yeah, five more seconds. All right, and relax. Left leg. There we go, try to find that new range of motion there. So a little extra pressure on top of that knee. Give me another 10 seconds. And five, four, three, Two and relax. Great job. Right, both hands underneath your right leg. Pull that knee up. Extend your right leg. Right hamstring stretch. There we go. Another 15 seconds. Great job. 
Same stretch, left leg. Once again, I want to remind everyone to maintain your neutral pelvis. Hey, Carrie. That Brennan? What up, Brennan? That's my dude right there. Good, and relax. All right, so now we're gonna stand up. Stretch out the quads and our calves. All right, so we're gonna stand up. Use your chair, all right? Place your right foot on your chair. And what you wanna do is stoop down on that left leg Shift your hips forward so you can feel that stretch along the front side of your quad. Hold the stretch. Keep stretching, keep stretching. Obviously, you can just do the standing quad stretch. This will do the same thing as long as both knees, your knee is pointed down to the floor. You can do that. That'll do the same thing. And relax. Same stretch. Left leg. So you can do either one. Standing quad stretch or you can use a chair, use a table, whatever is around you to help you keep your balance. Say carry. All right, and relax. All right, so we're going to plant your left foot into the floor, right toe. Okay. Again, you want a neutral pelvis. You don't want your your, your pelvis shift too far forward. You don't want it all the way back somewhere in the middle. Okay. Bend that right leg. Shift your hips forward. And if you can, drive that right heel into the floor. Hopefully, this will help stretch your. Uh, your calf. So make sure that your toes are pointed straight forward. Okay? Now, now that we have this stretch, I want you to take your right arm, reach over top. This will reach into the psoas area. Alright? Just open up the musculature of your hip. Good, and relax. Same stretch, I'm gonna turn around for you guys. Right foot forward, plant your left heel into the floor, hips forward there, bend the knee, try to stretch that calf, reach over top, the left. Stretching all up into the psoas. Go back to the quad stretch. You can do standing quad or you can use your chair, use your table, whatever's around you to help you balance. All right, ready? Knee pointed down to the floor, stretch. this stretch because you have to bend your your plant foot and get a little isometric contraction in that quad so you get the stretch and a little strength training at the same time good job folks all right left leg forward Plant your right heel into the floor, stretch that calf, shift your hips forward there, neutral pelvis, reach over top, your right arm, right leg.
leg back, right arm up. Good, and relax. Left leg forward, right leg forward, I'm sorry. Left leg back, plant your left heel into the floor. Reach over top, there you go. So as, stretch and calf stretch, that's what we're looking for. Great job, everyone. All right, all that's left to do is all downhill from here. Stretch out your chest, back, and shoulders. So, what we're gonna do, reach way back behind you there. Palms up, pretend like you're stepping through a doorway. Stretch your chest, all right? Another way you can do this is fingertips behind your ears, elbows back. This is called your prisoner stretch, so I'll let you choose which one you wanna do. I like this one a little better. Interlock those fingers. Push way out front. Bow out the back. We're stretching out the musculature of the upper back. This is the only exercise you get to practice bad posture. Right here. All right, bow out the back. Stretch the upper back. Five more seconds. And relax. Same thing. Interlock those fingers behind your back. Tell like somebody's pressing your shoulders down and back. Stretch those shoulders and traps. Another 15 seconds. Hold the stretch. we can release a little bit of stress and tension by stretching out these shoulders. Good, and relax. Back to the chest, step through your doorway here. Open it up. I feel like I should do something with my hands right here. I don't, I don't know what. Hold the stretch, nonetheless, 10 more seconds. Good, and relax. You lock the fingers, close it up. Good, and relax. Let's hit those shoulders one last time before we before we end it out here. And stretch. Good to see all those who decided to watch, take a stretch break with me. I appreciate all of you. Maybe you'll come back tonight, 7 p.m. for my Tabata class on Facebook Live. Remember, uh, these stretch breaks and our uh, wellness checks will be moving to Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. You can check our website for, for, for more details if you want. And relax. Great job. Hope everyone enjoys the rest of your day. Be safe. Take care.